So, uh, I'm thinking about writing a book. Okay, you're thinking about writing a book or you're going to write a book? Well, I'm going to write a book. All right, good, great. What's, uh, what's the book about? <laughs> I, th I think it wants to be about uh, women and men. Women and men? Yeah. And that really narrows it down. What do you mean, Barry? You know, what, that's really supportive. No, Barry, you're missing honestly. me. That's, you're missing me. No, I'm, no, no, no. I'm not missing you. No, no, no. You. It's not about being supportive or not. All I'm saying is a lot of stories are about women and men. In fact, I would argue that all of them are about women and men in some fashion or another. Okay. Well, I'm not serious about farm animals. Males and females. I'm sorry, honey. <laughs> it's a fact. That's bad. Okay. Yes. Well, well, mine is about relational dynamics in the modern age and what it really means to be in love. So I assume that you're drawing from personal experience. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. right. So what is it? You have some new perspective on the age-old concept of love? No, I'm not saying I'm, 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 you know, I'm coming up with something no one's ever discussed or covered before, but I'm, I'm saying that I might have a connection to my time, my generation, that uh, maybe I've got a perspective that's unique. Okay, okay. I what love that. No, this is great. We're looking at the Nora Ephron of modern day love oh affairs. <laughs> no, Nora Ephron's the Nora Ephron of modern day love affairs. Okay, okay. yeah, that's going to completely disregard Nancy Myers. What are you talking about? Nancy Myers. Nancy Myers. Myers. Nancy Myers. Myers. A book honey, about honey, love honey, 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 and relationships. Honey, honey, what? Okay, I'm sorry. I think it's actually delightful that after all these years of teaching American literature, Darren is finally venturing into American literature. Thank you, Veronica. That is very I apologize. It's not American literature, not yet. I need to write. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, sorry. Um. So I just ran into George Berman, of all people. I thought, I thought he was in New York. I don't know. No, it's quite all right, Kathy, because Darren here was just telling us how he finally wants to write a book. Ooh, don't, fun. Don't listen to him, What's but... it about? Oh, he well, he's not sure, but he thinks he wants it to be about love and relationships mm -hmm. or women and men or something groundbreaking mm -hmm. like that. Oh, my. <laughs> this is... Un... Well, that sounds like fun. It is fun, you know, and that's what I think. But I mean, Barry over here is jealous that I'm embarking Stop. upon an Stop. endeavor. No, you're, you're missing no, you're me. You always miss endeavor. me. No, I I'm, not miss I'm, not I'm not missing jealous. I'm not jealous you're embarking upon an endeavor. No, no, Stop. I'm supportive. I've always been jealous. supportive, honey. You coddle him. That's She's the truth. a great coddle. I coddle you. I know you. Anyway, yes, the she point does. Is, I want books to be written, right? I, I want paintings to be painted. I mean, who doesn't, right? I do. Sure. I just think that maybe, maybe uh -huh. you're not the most qualified person to write a book about love and relationships, especially a topic that's so obtuse. What are you oh, talking wait, wait, about? Wait, wait, wait. This well, is... Who's to say that any of us are qualified? Do that's exactly what I'm saying. Yeah, but that's, anyway, that's what I'm qualified. saying. I'm saying that. Do we leave else? any room for dessert? <sighs> no. What do you think? I don't know. Ah, uh, well, I would have said that chocolate lava cake, but that takes about 55 minutes. 55 minutes? <laughs> no. Yeah, 45 to 50. No, 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 not about the lava cake. We are having a discussion about the concept of love and relationships. What do you think about love and relationships? Uh, oh, well, uh, you know what, I'd have to say I got news for you. I am the wrong person to be talking to about this. <laughs> cake, yeah, relationships, no. Nah. No, 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 no. Why, why is that? Why is that? What's your name? My name? Uh, Polly. What's your name? Kathy. So why is that, Polly? Um, all right. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah all right. Get on in. You know, in here. If you don't mind me If you don't mind me saying, there's always three women in my life. And I think this applies to anybody. In, in any given moment, in any man's life, there's always three women involved. There's, there's the available, there's the unavailable, and there's the unattainable. But go on. Well, there's the one that you're dating, and there's the one that you want to date, and then there's the one that you can't date. Well, why can't you date her? Well, because she's uh, unattainable. I'll check back in a few. What an absolute peg. I thought that was very honest. Quite honest. Wow. He is not going to be a waiter much longer. I think that guy's going places. I think he's going places. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just don't understand how anyone can date more than one person at any one time. Who has time for that? Honestly. Well, I do it all the time, Samantha. Uh, and do you sleep with them? No, I just, you know. Smooch here and there. <laughs> smooch. Yeah, girl. I like to smooch. Right. You know, I think he seems to be getting into the argument of attraction. You mean the law of attraction? No, no, the argument of attraction. Yes, this is it. I like this. Elaborate on it, please. Yes. Well, this is the age-old notion about the idea that attraction is not just a one-sided thing, right? It's um, it's not just a feeling felt mm -hmm. by one party. It's it's um, it's not even a feeling. It's it's like an engagement felt by both parties. Thank you.
Well, yes, what he's talking about is that a man can be in love, you know, just madly in love, yes. you know, with the, with, the, with, the, with the woman, you know, and his presence is just so engaging, so enrapturing, so just, you know, powerful that, uh, that, that he's in love. He has to declare this notion. Mm -hmm. yet, the, yet the woman is with someone, you know, she, she's what uh, many might call stuck, or uh, she's on the safe road, or the easy path, so to speak, you know? Maybe she just wants to get married and have kids. Yeah. Maybe, that's right. Maybe she's that's smart. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, I like this. I like this. Smart enough. That is a wonderful argument, but love, I mean, love is just, it's so powerful, right? It's, it's, um... You can do it. No, no, it's a feeling, a, a concept beyond words, beyond... You can do it. Beyond it? utterance, it's... Mm. What is it? It's love. And it's haunting. And I'm drunk. <laughs> I'm drunk. I apologize. I'm drunk. Yeah, yeah. No, you're. you Well, he's 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 talking about a guy who's in, in love with a girl Ooh. who's unavailable in a relationship with a gal who's just uh, available and, and, and infatuated with a girl who's just unattainable. Right now, is this derived from personal experience? No, 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 doll, honey, they, you know, No, this is just this is just, these are human classical human struggles. Classical. These are things that we can all you know we all relate to. Think about the beginning of time. Think about the beginning of everything. You know. Uh, Adam and Eve, and Cain and Abel, and uh, Solomon and his thousands of wives. You know, I mean, you got you got cavemen picking a woman across the way with grunts. You know, cave women. You got uh, wars being fought and won over women. Well, what about I mean, monks? You, monks were too busy with God and brewing beer. Mm. Good point. You know, they're not. <laughs> That's a great point. They're not dealing with that situation. You know, but farmers. You know, you needed farmers. Farmers needed a woman around to produce more farmers, mm -hmm. right? So you just you, you know sooner or later, more and more options happen. More and more people happen. And life became full of options, and the grass was greener on the other side. You know, it was, it was greener all over. So green, we couldn't even focus on the grass we had. You know, and then you meet this great girl, and you think you know how to identify true love. <laughs> but, and then sooner or later, you, you're looking around and you're just engulfed with options. And you just can't figure out why you're, your relationship isn't working, why, why uh, you know, nothing seems to be working, and then, you, you know, everything's just starting to fall apart. And all you have is a bunch of surface-level relationships and a girl who's out there who loves you, the real you, who's ready to just put it all out there on the line for you and with you. But you were just too distracted by the shiny bullshit to even notice. And the grass you had just withered away. So you're saying we'd all be better off as farmers in the 1800s. <laughs> hey, there's your book. Right yeah. there. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if we're saying that, but uh, maybe, yeah, maybe. So the waiter, he's with the available girl. I mean, that's the woman he, he, in his life? Yeah, the one yeah. he's dating. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, then there's the unattainable. No, 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 that would be the unavailable. Yes. Now, which one is that? That's the one he's in love with. Yes. Like he's actually in love with. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay then, so does this mean that in any given moment in any woman's life that there are three men involved? Mm. Oh. oh. That's a great question. I like Honey, that. Honey, like yeah. yeah. answer appropriately. Oh, 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 oh. Honey? That's a good Don't question. Look at me. I mean, question. No, Darren, only eyes. Thank you. Hi. Uh, hi. Hi. Hey, hi guys. Hi. How are you? Oh my gosh. Gosh, hi. And, uh, good to see yeah. you. Jeez. Um, yeah, hi. God, hi. Oh, hi. You remember George? Yeah, hi, George. Hi, good to see you. How are you? Yeah. Good to see you. Yeah, I thought, uh, yeah, I thought you were in New York. I just got in yesterday. Ah, wow. so, oh, so you guys, uh, you, you moved here then? Uh. <laughs> no, no, no. She's moving here. Uh, I'm back and forth, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I don't, I don't, I never leave the city. You know. Well, this is a city. Uh, it's a city. <laughs> this is a city. Uh, that's on to something. That's true. I miss the city. You know from. Time to time. Yeah. Could uh, you sit down, have a drink, oh, or? No, actually, we're, 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 just have a drink. You guys. Wine. Yeah. 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 No, no, no. Fine. We're due at dinner. We just came by for a drink, so we gotta get to our reservation. Uh, yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Well, mm. uh, wow. Okay. Mm. Well, uh, anyway. Oh, uh, this is uh, my uh, fiance. Um, oh, Samantha. Samantha. Yeah. Samantha. <laughs> yeah. I know. 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 I'm Madeline. Oh, Madeline. I I've heard. And a lot about you. So oh, well, thanks. Not that I don't well, I mean, I, I've heard, I've heard enough. Like, I mean, I'm sorry. I sold so much wine. <laughs> um, anyway, 
nice to meet you. Congratulations. Cool. Thank yeah, you. It was really great to see you guys. You so too. we're going to yeah. get to... So okay, well, yeah, yeah great. Well, um, I guess we'll we'll see you guys. Uh, okay. Maybe. Okay. Not him. Right. He's not yeah, He doesn't leave the city. He doesn't leave the city, does he? Okay, well, I'll see you later. Bye, bye. Yes, okay, bye. Okay, thank you. Bye, bye, guys. see you guys. Great. Wow, it's great. Jeez, I, yeah, I thought that was yeah, yeah. Mm. whatever, right? <laughs> what? What was that? What was what? <laughs> Excuse me, please. You don't have to leave. You don't have to, honey, babe, doll, babe, honey. You call her Samantha when you talk to her. she's sweet. You stop? I'm she's sorry. She's very sweet. Go. Come on. Oh. Get, get yeah, together. Go, go. I'll take care of you. Yep. Oh, God. He's never going to get over her. No. <sighs> Honey. Hmm. That is an example right there. What? This is an example of how crazy life can be, right? What's he doing? He's sitting there, he's talking about how he wants to write a mm -hmm. book, about some existential, overwhelming, these amount of options in life or whatever the heck he was talking about, right? Yeah. And then this kid, mm -hmm. right, he comes to the table, he drops knowledge on us about women and men. Mm -hmm. And then of all the times and <laughs> all the places in the world, his ex almost white comes to the table out of the fucking blue and says, hi, uh -huh. are you kidding me? And then look what happens as a result. There it is. 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 So did you guys figure it out? What, d dessert? No, love and relationships.